If you struggle with coming up for content for your social platform as a social seller, network marketing, then this video is for you. So I have five tips that are going to help you get you five ideas to post. So keep on watching. Hey friend, it's Christina Torres. Welcome to my channel where I'm hoping to empower online boss moms with the social media strategies I have here on this channel and also sharing the products that have boosted my confidence. So when you think about planning for your content right now, I will let you know I have a whole 30 day caption ideas of ideas for you to create on your own to get your brain thinking about what you want to say to your audience is a free to you in the description box. So go ahead and grab that now. So here are some five post ideas that will help you that work because they are what I do. So the first thing that I want to share with you is funny memes. Right now, funny memes are really engaging. People are hilarious and they just like laughter. Like who doesn't like entertainment, right? So find a meme that relates to you in your niche of area and put it back in the caption on information in your niche. Someone in your niche that will understand the joke. So you could just Google over on YouTube, here on YouTube, funny memes, find something that calls to your heart and then think, get those creative reels thinking, your creative reel will um, thinking on how you can put you back to your audience on content information so the first one was memes the second one is just really simple is asking a question it could be any simple question to get help you with your engagement but be sincere on what you're asking your audience um, you know it's you can ask a question and put that background um, through this is Facebook the background color and ask any question that you want it could be relatable to right now the time of this video is summer do you prefer the beach or the poolside start those conversations this is a way for you to start conversations and comments and go into messenger and also my next step was going to be quotes so you can share any quotes with a few ways and the first one I'm going to tell you is you can put the quote and write the words behind the colored background but give a message so with a colored background, the quote card that you find or create your own on Canva, but don't just put that quote and that's it. Write a caption message for you to know like whatever that message is. Why does that quote call to your heart and give that message to your audience? People engage in that when you're telling them why it relates to you and then asking them what's their favorite quote. What quote helps them on their bad days? Another way also for you to engage through quotes information is having a selfie of you with that quote and sharing that next tip here is sharing that journey. So you can intertwine these ideas, but different ways of how you produce them. Now for me, when I do do quotes, um, perhaps more, maybe once a week where it's just a quote card, but I always say something, but I really feel to get better engagement and, and it works better on, this is more on these types are for Facebook and you can tweak them for Instagram, but it's wherever you are. Okay. Um, for me to really just put a self me of me with the quote and say something about it, or also just writing the quote in the background color. That's what really works for me. And my last tip per se is I already kind of said a selfie with your journey, but say that journey of you, whatever your story is, when you started your business, why you started, um, how it's going for you and at times you can share the um, the struggles because everyone might have struggles of your business journey. Um, don't wanna to have to share everything, but share a little bit to be a human so people can relate to you, okay? And my last tip, what is my last tip is, oh, what my last tip is to do a fast tutorial. So like right now, this is a long form video that I'm sharing here on YouTube. But what I feel that really works right now in the time in this video are fast tutorials and how you're going to create that is through a fast video here through your camera roll or you can go to Reels on Instagram and do a fast video. And it could be anything. Um, it could be if you're someone in the makeup journey, you can have your before face and your after face and then give some benefits of it. Just don't say it's on sale, but a really fast three to five seconds, 10 seconds the longest for you to get some kind of message across. If you just want to go on your reels and just do a talking with your original voice, so your audio, and give three tips and then just get to the point, but make it under 10 minutes, three to five seconds really work because they have to hit that button to like, oh, what do they say or what do they show? Um, but just doing some fast tutorials that give benefits. All these little simple tips that I have shared with you really help you for you to show up with your business having a content library. Again, if you need help with those, I have a whole free 30-day caption ideas to create some content for you in the description box below 
So I hope this helps you. If you got value from this video, please like the video, just subscribe to the channel, and I will leave my whole video I did on anything that's relatable for content buckets is one of my favorite ones that I talk about. I'll leave that here and I will find another one that's going to be relatable to you for this information. So I hope this helps you. Take care. God bless. Until the next video. Bye.